September 10th, the Port of Philadelphia received its first cargoes from Fibria Cellulose at the Tioga Marine Terminal. The ships arrived from Brazil, and the cargo is primarily wood pulp sourced from eucalyptus trees, a product used to manufacture a full range of personal hygiene and household products, including paper towels and facial tissues. Specially modified forklifts, allowing for fast, damage-free transfer, move the cargo from Berthside to Tioga's on-dock warehouse. I'm a, I'm a member of the local 1291 Stevedores here at DRS. We're loading pulp in the rail cars right now. Uh, it's a major contract for us. It's given all of us younger guys uh, a lot of work and a lot of money to move forward in the local. I think our productivity is just going to get better from here. I mean, um, we're just getting started. A lot of us haven't ever done this before. And um, now that we have the opportunity, and I think we're um, meeting expectations, and I think we'll, uh, we'll definitely go uh, far past their, uh, their quota. Initial business is projected to amount to 30,000 metric tons per month resulting in about 360,000 tons annually. 455 direct and indirect jobs will be created by this new business. Fibria's activity will also generate $1.74 million in state and local taxes each year. Current upgrades to the Port Richmond track and rail corridor, justified by new business such as Fibria's, will facilitate the inland movement of Fibria's cargoes.